Hello, all you beautiful people. Fellow worker here, coming from the tundra of the Halloween Nunavut, Canada. Let's have a look at where I am laying down. Ah, I just wanted to take another moment sitting on the moss, feeling Mother Earth beneath my bum. The beginning fragrances of Labrador. Oh, I wish you could smell it. Here's what it looks like. So this is the Labrador used to make tea. It is... It's got these little evergreen looking leaves on it. I believe this has been used by Inuit for centuries and it smells so good. Here's some more. Look at this beautiful rock and all the lichen on it. Again, it might not be that impressive to you but when you live here and you see how barren it can be for so much of the year, these few months of summer are so beautiful and glorious. Before the mosquitoes come out, of course. <laughs> and they are not here today, in this hour right now. So perfect for filming for you all, so I don't have to be swatting my face like in some other videos. Ah, I'm just enjoying a moment here. These little, these things here, I forget the name, but they are going to make berries. Again, it might look fairly barren to you, but when you actually dig into the tundra, you just see so much life and diversity. These are homes for lemmings that I never see. Oh, there's a bug. It's a spider. Oh, get on the camera. Oh. I believe that this is Heather. I believe this is Arctic Willow, and these little tufts here create a little cotton that comes out soon, and Inuit have used that in the Kulik to start fires like a wick, and they use seal oil.
many, many varieties of lichen here in the Arctic. <clears throat> I certainly do not know how to identify it, but I'm pretty sure it's lichen. Look at this beauty.